Namaste friends and I hope you're doing well. Um, we are going to talk about the Dhrishti's uh, aspects. Dhrishti's are very very important uh, components in Vedic astrology. What it does is uh, it gives the astrologer a, uh, a collective understanding on what the house and the graha are being influenced with. Okay. Uh, so there's something called drishti or literally meaning the sight or gazing or looking that's what it means so there are certain um, grahas which has special sight but generally speaking um, uh, certain rules must be followed in order to uh, take into consideration this aspect of drishti if you look at this first chart here let me open it up for you you see there is something called a quarter site. So all grahas, uh, regardless, right, any graha, it has a quarter site on the third and the seventh house. Um, a quarter, so you have the quarter, you have the half, the three quarter and the full site. Uh, in precedence, of course, the full site has the most influence uh, and three quarter, half and quarter uh, is going downwards, right? The influential level gets lower when it goes uh, lower. So a quarter of a site for all grahas, so any grahas, take for example, let's say um, Saturn, Saturn uh, does um, a, a quarter graha, a quarter, I'm sorry, a quarter drishti or aspect on the third and the seventh house, okay? Um, now let's look at the other one and all grahas do this half a site the half site for all grahas are the fifth and the ninth house uh, the three quarter site for all grahas uh, are on the fourth and the eighth house and lastly the full site for all grahas is the seventh house which means any grahas it has the full influence on the seventh house okay uh, there are also special uh, sites uh, or uh, drishtis like for Mangal or Mars um, besides looking at the 7th it also looks at the 4th and the 8th so 4, 7, 8 are the special uh, drishtis or special site by Mangal uh, the other one would be Brihaspati Guru Guru looks at uh, 5 and 9 apart from 7 and Saturn, Sunny, Rahu and Ketu, Saturn, Rahu and Ketu looks at the 3rd and the 10th apart from the 7th uh, Graha. Okay, so this looking at or gazing means that it has influence depending on its levels like, like quarter, half, three quarter and full. All these things must be taken into consideration. Without going through this, uh, we may not come to a... Uh, proper prediction and our predictions may turn out to be wrong so it is imperative uh, that uh, we must follow these drishtis or aspects okay so i hope this video has somewhat been beneficial so please stay tuned for more videos from prakash jyotisa till the next time thank you namaste